who said that the land of Valisthea is blessed in the light of the Mother Crystals. And that it was this light which finally led our forebears out of the darkness. Yet, what they saw in the light gave rise to temptation. Temptation that ever lures us back into the crystal shadow. And the still journey begin. Okay, I'm in the game. This looks amazing. I also didn't expect it to start immediately like it like it did, which is why part of the opening cutscene was cut out. But this is awesome. God, I'm so excited for the game to be released and I just started playing it. It looks like I'm playing as a phoenix right now. Oops, didn't mean to do whatever that was. Oh my god! It'll be light soon. Both camps have begun to stir. You all know the target. Shiva's dominant. And only the dominant. No one else? Where's the fun in that? How do we even know the girl will be among them? Our kind do not question orders. We follow them. Try to keep that in mind. Let's get this done. Focus, Wyvern. You are key to this mission's success. Yes, Sergeant. Well, for those of you that don't... Shut up! For those of you that don't know, 
I am playing Final Fantasy 16 demo. We don't have time for this. All hell is about to break loose. And so far, it is amazing. Time to move. Definitely different from Final Fantasy 15. Your swords to our cause! Come now. Marshal, the King of Walud is our guest. And you have His Majesty's answer. you summoned us at all? Have you so little faith in your own men? It was the Dalmex who drove back the Crusaders in the Battle of the Twin Realms, was it not? Or am I mistaken? Besides... Your dominant has yet to take the field. And when he does, our knights would only get in the way. Perhaps you have not heard, but the Iron Blood now have their own dominant. We would be fools to underestimate them. Bugger their knights. What did you say? Should this citadel be allowed to fall? <sighs> the capital will lie exposed. And I doubt the Crusaders will wait for the good king's pawns to line up before taking to the board. Which just leaves me. Hoka! The Iron Blood will rue the day they set foot on Storm. This game is over. You cock. <laughs> Bene 
addict, huh? <laughs> take care. Does the lion take care when he chases the hare? Or do you think me one of the latter? No, my love. You are a lion. You're my lion. <laughs> I'm not afraid of a little frost, Benedicta. But I will need someone to warm me when I come home. <laughs> the front lines are gone. This is our chance. The chaos will conceal us. I'm glad that didn't escalate any further. The music is amazing. And quick and deadly, as always. <sighs> Take the van. Wait. Something's not right. Oh my god. Titan. So the Darmax finally grew tired of being slaughtered. Look who's here to greet the bastard. Come on. to die here wyvern move that was so cool right on top of us. that titan looks amazing in this music oh it's so awesome any 
time, Wildburn. Yep, can't go that way. Would have been cool if I could, though. you before you do not get to die here If you're not cut out to be a shield, there's always work for you in the stables. Unless, of course, you think you can defend your master while sat on your ass in a puddle of pig swill. I'm sure he'd find a way. My brother always looks after me. <laughs> right? Go on. You're sure to hit him eventually. Don't give up now. Arms, then. It wouldn't do to disappoint the gallery. Let's start again from the beginning. Come, show me your form. So is this the past then? Press square to perform a melee attack up to four. Okay. Very good. Such swordsmanship will serve you well in the field. But can the same be said of your spellcraft? The flames of the phoenix burn within you. Now let them burn without. Come, Clive. Rain fire down upon me. Time to look at the spells. <sighs> yeah, that looks awesome. Excellent. <sighs> Well done. You wield the Firebird's flames just as a first shield should. You flatter me, my lord. Or would you rather I flattened you? Can be arranged. Let's see if you can elude my blade. After all, your attacking prowess will count for naught if you don't live long enough to use it. On your toes, Lord Rossfield. R1 to evade? Okay, that's gonna be weird going from circle to R1. Because I've been playing Lies of P a lot. Keep trying, Clive. Yep, which I just press circle. That is a nice evade, though. 
Was I not clear as to the purpose of this exercise? Yeah, it's for me to kill you. I wish. Good. Move only when you must. Try to evade my attacks. No, I want to attack you. Okay, so if you evade at the last second, then it's a precision dodge. Your blade is not your only weapon. Quickness of thought and fleetness of foot are indispensable arms in any shield's arsenal. But you are not just any shield, are you? Show me what sets you apart from the rest. You have been blessed by the Phoenix. Granted the use of its power. Call upon that power now to close on you. Well, I'm waiting. Oh, uh, that's what circles used for. Okay. Was it all our shields could move so swiftly? That's pretty cool. But even the most agile shield cannot hope to escape every blow. And death may come by a handful of cuts as easily as it comes by a thousand. There is only one way to ensure that you do not fall. Keep your wounds mended and your energies replenished. Speaking of which, my lord, you seem a little worse for wear. Well, that won't do at all. Oh, nice healing. That's better. Battle is a succession of pivotal moments, wherein life and death can be decided at a single stroke. You must be ready to utilize every tool at your disposal if you are to navigate a path to victory. Or at the very least, to ensure that you live to fight another day. Enough practice. It's time for the test. You've recovered from your soaking, I trust. You wouldn't want to kick a man while he's drowned. I thought you'd never ask. Come then, Lord Rosfield. Spar with me. If you believe yourself worthy to be called Shield of the Flame, then prove it. As you wish, my lord. Now I get to fight him. Make proof of your strength. The will gauge indicate the fight back, break the spirit by landing attacks and strike. Okay. No one, you're sure to beat him this time. You can do it, Clive. Just stay calm. <laughs> You're taking this seriously. Keep going, Clive. Staggering your enemies. Lord Murdoch's will has been broken, leaving him staggered. Try dealing as much damage as you can before he regains his senses. Use R2 plus square to execute rising flames, a powerful iconic ability granted Clive. Yeah, granted Clive by the blessings of the Phoenix. Well, it's time I took my own advice. I used all the tools at my disposal. Come on, Clive! Keep pressing! Just a little more. We the combats are really awesome. Well, this is actually where I'm going to end this first episode. Don't mind my squeaky chair. I still need to get a new one. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, then please like, subscribe, and hit that post notification bell to always receive a notification every time I post a video. See you guys in the next one. Bye.